Have you ever accidentally deleted a file you really needed or maybe your computer crashed and suddenly all your important documents or even precious memories like photos and videos were gone? I think we have all been there at least once and that sinking feeling when you realize you have no idea how to get them back it's not fun. This is where a recovery software comes in. I've tested many data recovery softwares in the past and today we are going to talk about Wondershare Recoverit. It's a data recovery tool that claims to help retrieve over thousand types of files from different storage devices. But the big question is, will it be able to recover our files? In this video, I'll walk you through how Wondershare Recoverit works, showcase its features and real world scenario and give you my honest take on whether it's worth your time. Let's dive in. Hey, Shivam here and you can check out Recoverit from the affiliate link in the description below. Data loss can happen to anyone. Maybe you formatted the wrong drive, emptied your recycle bin too quickly, or dealt with a corrupted hard drive. According to reports, 68% of data loss is caused by hardware failure while the rest can be blamed on the accidental deletion, malware, or software crashes. Wondershare Recovery claims to support recovery across multiple scenarios like formatted drives, deleted files, even issues like OS crashes or corrupted data. Disclaimer, before we begin, I want to tell you something. Recovery softwares can't always perform miracles. Sometimes you are able to get back your files and sometimes you don't. There are a lot of technical things that determine the possibility of recovery. It is suggested that you stop using that hard drive immediately to prevent overriding your lost files. Anyway, what I'm interested in finding out is how reliable Recoverit is for the average person who just want to recover that one important lost file. So what exactly is Wondershare Recoverit and how does it help? It's a software tool that works on both Windows and Mac and allows recovery from a huge variety of storage devices. This includes USB drives, SD cards, hard disks, and even digital cameras. According to its specs, it supports over 1000 file types including photos, videos, documents, and emails. One feature recovery promotes heavily is its ability to recover large video files without corruption. Videos are tricky files to recover because they're often fragmented on storage disks. It solved this by rebuilding these fragments, which is especially useful for creative professionals handling high-res video content, just like me. Additionally, Recoverit has improved its recovery capabilities for external storage devices, boasting a recovery success rate of up to 99.5%. But now let's take a closer look at how it works. Using the app is pretty easy. After getting the recovery license, download the software and install it. Once you open the app, the interface is clean and beginner friendly. The first thing you will see is a list of storage devices connected to your computer. This could be your main hard drive or external hard drive or even a crashed OS. To start, we simply select the location where our files were lost. Once we hit the start button, it begins scanning for recoverable files. This can take a few minutes or longer depending on the size of the drive. As the scan progresses, we'll see a list of potential recoverable files populated in real time. It breaks these down into categories images, documents, videos, and so on, making it easier to find what we are looking for. But I liked it lets us preview files before recovering them. This means we won't waste time recovering irrelevant files. Once we have selected the files we want, click recover. Choose allocation to save them, and we are done. Just make sure to save the files on a different hard drive to avoid overwriting issues. I am a content creator, so I do run into corrupted SD cards and Premiere Pro files because of crash from time to time. And in the past, I've been able to use Use this software to recover my videos or Premiere Pro files most of the time. So for the sake of this video, let's delete a couple of videos from this SD card and see if we can recover it. Just as we saw earlier, how to do the scanning. So let's start the process. The preview feature helps us to confirm everything was intact before we finalize the recovery. and see our videos are back. Let's pause and talk about some of the features I noticed while using the app. If you work with large video files, think 4K or even 8K footage, the advanced video recovery and reconstruction tools will help. It doesn't just retrieve fragments, it restores them into playable video files. For times when the operating system won't boot, it provides a bootable drive creator. It lets us recover our data even when our computer isn't functional, something that could potentially save hundreds of dollars on professional recovery services. Recoverit also includes a tool for repairing corrupted photo and video files, which isn't something we see in all recovery software. Now let's talk about pricing because honestly, this is where some people hesitate with recovery software. Recoverit offers a free version, but it's very limited, only allowing us to recover up to 100 MB of data. For large files or additional features, we'll need to upgrade to paid plans. You can see the pricing on the screen. 
we get monthly, yearly and perpetual plans. You can decide which one suits you the best. The pricing is competitive compared to alternatives like Ezers or Desk Drill. But if you are someone who deals with data loss frequently, the investment might be worth it. You can check it out from the link in the description. However, that's it from my side. Hope you guys found this video helpful. Now, if you are looking for a way to create animated explainer videos, then this video will help. And if you are looking for a way to run Windows on your Mac, then there you go. Like, share, subscribe, stay safe. Bye-bye.